C'est elle, euh, elle qui a été à l'initiative de tout ça. Voilà, Cécile, comment est-ce que tu as décidé d'exposer cet artiste Comment, comment avez-vous décidé d'exposer cet artiste ici En fait, euh, il y a eu euh, Paola Mani qui m'a parlé de son concept tout au début de l'année. Elle m'a demandé si je voulais participer aussi. Alors, j'ai connu l'artiste euh, Laurel Colomane. Elle a bien voulu justement exposer aussi à mon amour parce qu'elle aimerait bien se faire aussi. À mon amour, c'est quelque chose d'extraordinaire. Mais alors là, est-ce que tu es en tant que président du Lady Lunch, Lady Lunch complètement dépendamment Complètement dépendamment par ma société C2M événementielle. D'accord. Merci. Voilà. Et alors vous parlez anglais ou français Speak French or English English. So where are you from I'm from Los Angeles. From Los Angeles. And you came all the way from Los Angeles to Monaco to showcase your art um, so you told me that you came all the way from Los Angeles, but your painting was there already. Yes, because um, this painting showed um, in Paris in July. And um, actually, I have a Biennale running in Buenos Aires with two pieces from the same collection. So I actually went to Buenos Aires and then came here. So and what is the name of your collection? This is the fifth element. It was 28 paintings. It was for a Paris show that covered five rooms, and it covers the four major elements, with the fifth element being quintessence. Or Love. So every picture, even though abstract, some of them are abstract landscapes, so they paint around it images. Basically, either is about air or water or earth or fire. So, so um, uh, how long have you been painting? When did? When is the um, first time you ever painted? In undergraduate. So I have an art degree in undergraduate, and I painted during that time. And then I also studied performance art and theater, and then I alternated between theater. And, and do you remember when you were a child, like? Five years old, six years old? Yes, I won an art contest <laughs> when I was like nine years old. Oh, come on. So that was very exciting. And but so how would you describe specifically, specifically your art? I think that I paint because I'm uh, I'm obsessed with the language of science. I think I'm influenced by science and uh, cell division, reproduction, um, earth, water, um, the changes, uh, kind of the, the how and why we are here. And I am influenced by Paul Klee. I love symbolism. I love color-filled painters like Rocco. Um, I, I kind of want to take uh, symbolism and create my own language and ask my own questions and um, like the painting behind me is called The Secret Language of Whales and it was inspired by a documentary called Blackfish and it was all about, I was so upset after I saw the documentary because I saw how this intelligent animal we're caging and we should be doing it and I'm not a figurative painter and so I wanted to paint the connectivity of the, these animals how the babies are connected to the mommies and how they discuss, you know, connect to each other and so basically this is my language of that connectivity and so it fit really nicely in the Monaco Yacht Show because it's all about water and it's all about the sea life and animals and if you go upstairs there's a painting called Sea Bound which is a seagull taking off into the sky and in the, in the Yacht Club there's a painting called the Seal which is very abstract but it looks like a seal playing in the water so this was the situation where these pieces fit perfectly on a yacht. Yeah, although very large pieces. Let me film the pieces and I thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Did we get it? Oh, you got that. This is so I'm <laughs> 